Okay guys, so another thing I noticed right when I walked in the front door were these vertical screens here inside the office. And Joel, just tell me, what, what, what do we got here? Like, it's basically a computer because I saw you touch it like a computer. Yep. Talk to me. Yep, so this is a touch screen, which we can show you some easy video of that. I've got some cool stuff I'll do. But as you can see, this is a great display piece. So remember when Joe was asking, or you may not have seen it yet, but Joe Bonnet asked about how do we do, can we do high res graphics on our dance floor? Well, this was my answer to that. When I DJ and I'm doing some pretty big, cool events, like big parties and stuff like that, obviously not your normal wedding, uh, as the DJ part, I wanted to have something that had our logos. I play with bands, I do different stuff. And so I noticed the bands get away with having their logo on the drum. Why can't I have my logo on anything? So it seemed to be like this, no, you can't do it. But corporate stuff, boom. We put this up on the stage. We had one on either side of us and we just had our logo and we would animate it and just have cool effects happening with our logos. There's easy stuff you can do online with that. But we would just have cool stuff running on it. And then I was like, let's do slideshows. Guess what? Brides love these for slideshows. Cocktail hour, it's hanging out. It's showing all the dope pictures, their engagement. No, everyone always is like, hey, I'm gonna put this on a little laptop or I'm gonna put it on this monstrosity. This is your answer right here. The cool thing about this is if somebody's like, hey, I'm not gonna be able to get you the images um, until that event, you can plug it right in the back. There's a thumb drive. But what we do is these are actually Wi-Fi capable. We put these on a server and we upload it ahead of time. The corporate client can see it, we can show them. Everybody's happy. Right now it's just running a bunch of different magazines that we're in apparently. There's the car sitting on the floor, yeah. that's the McLaren uh, with our DJ booth behind it if you recognize that. Sick. So yeah, this is a beautiful piece. This really, the possibilities are endless. We've, we've done corporate events where they come into the hotel and I looked at the hotel and I was like, they give them that little tiny square piece, you know what I'm talking about? Yeah. Where you actually walk in and it's like, okay, that's what room IBM is in. Yeah. IBM doesn't want to be a small logo. Yeah. So they're happy to pay you something to give them a big logo. But sure. guess what? It can also have, uh, we have a, a company that we're doing stuff with where we have the entire itinerary laid out on there. Yeah. And then they're like, you know what? We have 20 different award winners. And I'm like, oh, well, let's just make a slideshow of the award winners where it just runs with the awards. And so yeah. people can see who they are after the announcement. Boom, they did it. Easy. So, so I mean, this, this is like the, the how digital. Good that looks. Yeah, the digital crazy clear. Like, yep. I don't know how well it comes to, yep. but like crazy clear imagery. Um, I can see this being really cool at wedding shows. This is the, the digital replacement of your, your pop up banner. Yes. Like the pop up banner is. I don't been around for 25 years. This is it much cooler? I do like this. Chris, are you shooting low enough to see the bottom? I was going to say that know. too. Yeah. Yeah. So if you notice, he's got it branded with a corporate client that they did some work for, but he just put Velcro on the back of it and he has it permanently what? branded, branded <laughs> with uh, the lethal rhythms brand. So, yep. you know, that permanently stays up there. But like you said, if he's doing something for Ansira, it's just Coroplast or whatever, you get somebody to basically do a quick little sign, boom, yep. stick it right over that. So, I like that as well because it it has so many different uses. Not only can he use it for his own personal brand, you know, do a wedding show or do a show where it's got lethal stuff on it, but he can also basically enhance a party that he's doing for a wedding, a client, you know, whatever. So yep. these are super cool. And, and again, this is something you can rent. These are probably more affordable. So if you are interested in possibly buying them, reach out to Joel as well on these. And what do you call it? Yeah, we call it digital display banners. There we go. Digital so display banners. You put digital in people's minds, they understand. I, and I'm going to step in front of Joe Bunn for yeah, a second. All right. You probably cannot see that unless I push this button, but it's a full computer as well. Yeah. So you have the computer system in there. You can you can have stuff saved as screensavers. We have a, we will set them up for you so that when you plug it in, it instantly goes into the mode of your images. You don't have to plug it in and try to search for stuff. Remember, I'm a DJ too. I don't like to do that when I'm trying to set up for my show or whatever. So we have this all prepared ahead of time. And like I said, you can plug a thumb drive in the back and it will automatically, when you turn it on, go straight to the thumb drive. We had it set up that way, you know, just like you would on if, if you have emergency settings on your computer and you plug something and it reads it, this will automatically pull the images and put them into the player for you uh, as soon as it turns on. This is just right now, it's the computer screen because Joe Bunn actually touched it. Um, and this is our backdrop image. So you can even have that going. You could have your logo sitting there and then when you actually wanna start your setup, then you hit the button. So during the whole setup, a cocktail hour, the corporate event or whatever, it's your logos on display on the banner. And then when it's time for the party to go or whatever, you can go into your party shots or whatever. And th there you go. And there's just unlimited opportunities. It's just all about creativity. And as DJs, we have to be creative to be successful. 
that's just the way it is. There's the floor matching the bride's dress like I was talking I about it. earlier. All right, guys, we are back. We are on stage. We are at a festival. Literally on stage. <laughs> I'm just kidding. We're not at a festival. We're still at Lethal Labs here right outside of Atlanta, Georgia. We are behind another one of Joel's amazing creations. What do you call this thing? This is called the Digital DJ Video Booth. Dude. That's what we that's what we put on paper. When we talk to people, we just say video booth, DJ video booth. I'm telling you, I know that there's a lot of video booths on the market. Uh, this is not that. This thing is super cool. It is basically comprised of several triangular components. Components. Yep. Are these first question components, these triangles, the same type? stuff that we saw on the video wall yes okay yes so this technology here yeah um, i started before i got the wall i started with the booth and <laughs> can you see i can and uh, right now we're running some different designs as you can see and we'll show you some other killer stuff from parties or whatever but i wanted to have something of course personalization i love this it's kind of got the whole like darth vader ship look to it right uh the expert whoever can reach out to Joe Bunn, tell him what that's called. It's not the TIE fighter, I forgot what it's called. The yeah, X-Wing or something, Y-Wing is the <laughs> Rebels, who knows. Anyway, we really like the look of this. We can do 10 different shapes because each one of these comes apart. We can build something like a Legos kind of feel. Um, and then you, you run your signal through it and you got some, as you can see right now, it's the speaker with some really dope stuff. And you can see from this side what's actually running because we're running it through a program. Right. Did so, that answer your question? Yeah, okay, yeah absolutely, good. man. I, I mean, get excited on this thing. No, I, dude, it's super cool. <laughs> and again, you know, on the back side of it, it's it's got your your Ethernet cables basically that are sending the video signal to each one. Yep. Then I guess they each kind of daisy chain together to power them, just like the yep. video wall that we were talking about earlier. Yep. yep. And so this whole thing basically then goes to a frame. So you guys pack this up. Each piece is kind of modular. Yep goes in road cases then it has the frame that it all kind of builds to yeah we keep the frame together it's just easier with our trucks we use you know lift gates but you could easily break this frame down it's yeah. a dj booth there's so many there's so many uh types of dj video booths and stuff where you have to bring your own table um you know you get the screens or whatever this is all built together uh, for many reasons. We yeah. really like, we like we do with everything else. We spend a couple of issues figuring everything out, going a couple of different ways. That's what the lab is. We test everything here. Uh, we got a new design we're working on, Joe saw too. Yep. But this one here, we built this the way it is. So it's just like a DJ, but you could totally break it down into components and, t and take it anywhere really in any kind of vehicle, I think besides a Volkswagen. Yeah, for, <laughs> sure. for sure. We're definitely gonna show you guys some different configurations that they built. He does an award show called the Diamond Awards. He's built, you know, a diamond shaped one. Um, I mean, it's it's again limitless kind of uh, possibilities in terms of what can run on the screen, the shape, um, and again, this is something that if you're trying to go next level or you've got that client that has the big budget that's got all the money left over from 2020 and 2021 that they didn't spend because the world was shut down, and now wants to have some kick-ass holiday party or award show and they're like what else do you have well what else do you have and you don't have it well now you do again we're going to put joel's contact info right down here on the bottom of the screen today we've seen the led video wall we've seen the led dance floor led digital dj booth we've seen the vertical screens over by the front door there's so much stuff that he has that i haven't even seen that I feel like I'm gonna have to come back and do a part two so I don't miss my flight today. <laughs> but here's the beauty of it. Uh, now my son goes to college here, so I'm gonna be in his area a lot more coming to see things because I mean, he he's literally got a shipment showing up this afternoon. I'm not gonna say what it is because we'll show it in part two of uh, some other uh, party effects. We'll just call them that. Yep, yep. Uh, that he's kind of come up with and um, worked with his engineers and designers and manufacturers overseas with and that are showing up today. So I can't possibly wait to get back <laughs> here and, and do it part two because there's some things we just didn't get to and there's some things on a shipping container on their way here. So we're super stoked. Um, any any final words, closing words today? Uh, yeah, a couple thoughts yeah. is 
New Year's. Yeah. These types of things are huge for New Year's parties or even nightclub parties, bars, type stuff like that. You'd be amazed. We've, we're in Atlanta, but we've done some really cool parties with this DJ booth just for like theme parties, right? So the opportunities for this thing are ridiculous. Um, it's just, it's, it's another step up in your game. If you're looking to like, how can I get more business? These types of things will definitely help you. We have opened up a whole new door just because of our digital market. And again, technology. The technology-based companies love this stuff. But I'm sure as a DJ, when you saw this, you're like, whoa, like it brings out the kid in you. I will tell you, uh, there's so many things I could tell you, but one of the things I want to tell you is at corporate shows, we have people come stand in front of these and make it their backdrop for their picture. Yes, yeah. So we just did a corporate show uh, here in Atlanta for about 500 people. And the first hour we had the floor, we had the video booth, we had lights, we had all kinds of stuff going on. And it was crazy to me that the people were coming up and standing in front of this and this was their backdrop. They were like, to heck with the 360 booth. They weren't using those as much. They were just coming right up and using this as their backdrop. And they do the same thing with the dance with floor. With him probably right in the background of every I was single like, shot. I guess I got to drop down a little bit lower. I dropped to Joe Bunn's level. So <laughs> this sounds like 6'2". I showed up, I'm like, damn it. Hey, man, you got some people on your team. What's that dude in Tennessee? That dude is tall. Oh, he's tall. Trailer's real tall. He's dude, damn near seven foot. He is crazy. He'd be like stepping down. And down. Yeah, yeah. So oh. my, uh, any, okay, I'm I didn't want to cut you. All right, my, my final words are this. If you're wanting to go next level, you want to be a yes man or a yes woman, and you want to be able to tell people you've got this or you've got that or you've got the next big thing, just know that you've got somebody on your team. Again, we'll put his uh, contact info right here to be able to reach out to Joel and at least pitch it to him. Hey, Joel, I'm in Tampa, Florida. Hey, Joel, I'm in Houston, Texas. I'm in wherever. He has multiple units and can probably get them to you, set it up for you. You show up and look like an absolute rock star. If you don't have the, the funds or don't want to go into debt, uh, you don't have the labor, uh, you don't have the storage. This is a big warehouse, nothing like my little thousand square foot office. If you don't have that stuff, you've got a partner here that you can reach out to and ask questions about this stuff and hopefully get it to your market and make you look like a star. Again, as always, thank you all for watching. Make sure you subscribe to this channel. Make sure you drop a like and a comment and I'll get back to you personally. Thanks again for watching. We're out. Thank you all. Peace.